For thousands of years, builders have used an old technique called overexcavation and replacement to address the problem of placing buildings on weak and compressible soils. The process entails excavating and removing a large volume of poor soil where the structure or footing would bear, replacing it with stronger material, and then compacting the better material to support the footing. For projects in which overexcavation was impractical, Deep foundations such as driven piles were used instead, an expensive and environmentally insensitive process of driving concrete, steel, or wood into the ground. In the early 1990s, GeoPeer Foundation Company developed rammed aggregate pier systems as an efficient and cost-effective alternative to historically costly and environmentally insensitive solutions. Up until now, a consulting geotechnical engineer has one primary question to answer on every design project that he does, and that is, uh, can this structure be supported on shallow foundations or does it need to go to deep foundations? In other words, is it an inch or is it a mile? Now he has another option. Does it have to be deep foundations or can it be intermediate foundation and less expensive and more practical? The unique GeoPeer construction process utilizes pre-augering and vertical impact ramming energy to construct the rammed aggregate pier elements. First, a cavity is drilled according to design specifications, usually 7 to 30 feet. Layers of aggregate are then introduced into the cavity in thin lifts of about one foot in thickness. A proprietary and patented beveled tamper rams each layer of aggregate using vertical impact ramming energy. This pre-stresses and pre-strains the aggregate at the bottom of the cavity while forming a bottom bulb. Then, thin lifts are incrementally placed and rammed until the pier is constructed. The result is superior strength and stiffness. For sites with soils that are unstable during drilling or with soils that are contaminated, GeoPeer Foundation Company has developed the Impact System, another proprietary and patented rammed aggregate pier method. The impact system is cost-effective for installations in soils subject to caving, like saturated sand. The key to the process is a specially designed tamping mandrel that allows aggregate to flow through it into the cavity while displacing loose surrounding soils. The method of installation builds up lateral stress in the soil. We believe this is pretty important because uh, the more you confine the soil laterally, the stronger it is and the less, uh, less compressible it is. And we believe this is a major feature that tends to minimize the settlement of the uh, GeoPeer Foundation system. Lateral stress also affects bearing capacity. In fact, our bearing capacity equations are built on the premise that it's not the soil underneath the foundation that holds it up, it's the soil alongside that keeps the soil underneath from squeezing out. Now, if we can further confine that soil with lateral stress, uh, we'll end up with a higher bearing capacity. The GeoPeer Foundation system provides stronger and stiffer elements to control foundation settlements, greater support capacity to reduce foundation cost, optimal quality control through visual inspection of drilled spoils, Ability to support compression, uplift, and lateral loads for use in a wide range of structures. Recycled aggregates to help with lead certification goals. And more than two decades of proven foundation support. One of the practical reasons from my standpoint to use GeoPeers is the foundation design gets to be a conventional spread footing, which in our office moves faster, is easier to execute than doing a lot of grade beams and, and different pile caps. This was a good fit for GeoPeer on this site because we were looking to save money in the foundations. We had soil characteristics that would accept a GeoPeer system and definitely be improved with the technique. 
Rammed aggregate pier soil reinforcing elements are commonly used to reinforce poor soils to support floor slabs in lieu of costly and time-intensive deep foundations and structural slabs or massive excavation and recompaction. Rammed aggregate pier supported floor slabs allow for the use of lightly reinforced slabs compared to expensive structural slabs. In areas subject to seismic shaking, foundations are loaded with increased compression, uplift, and lateral forces. The high friction angle of the piers resists lateral loads. Uplift anchors are installed within the piers to reduce upward loads. The potential for liquefaction is reduced through a combination of seismic shear stress attraction to the very stiff rammed aggregate pier elements and matrix soil improvements. We have a problem on this site with liquefiable soils. We're very close to an active fault. Uh, we have saturated soils down 16 feet and lower. We had anticipated uh, seismically induced settlements of up to five to six inches. We had to correct that. These rammed aggregate pier advantages work successfully together, contributing to reduction of both liquefaction potential and dynamic settlement. We're providing two different types of support here on this project. We have both foundation support by stiffening and strengthening and also providing liquefaction mitigation at the same time. And with these soil conditions, we can provide uh, bearing pressures of up to 6.5 KSF or 6,500 PSF. For highway and railroad projects, rammed aggregate pier elements exhibit a high friction angle, which increases bearing capacity and stability factors of safety. The piers reduce embankment and wall settlements, eliminating the need for staged construction. For railroad projects, the piers are used to reduce track deflections and improve the transition zones between railroad bridges and embankments. The system solves slope failures, reduces track settlements, and minimizes downtime for track maintenance stabilization. Biofuel and liquid storage tanks impart high shearing stresses at the edge of the tanks, often resulting in differential settlement and edge instability. Engineered rammed aggregate pier solutions reduce tank settlement and increase stability. The rammed aggregate pier elements are used to support wind tower foundations, resisting significant overturning moments while providing improved rotational and dynamic stiffness. Geo Pier Foundation Company is a member of the United States Green Building Council and has lead accredited professionals on staff. On green building projects, our rammed aggregate pier systems can contribute to lead credits helping the project to meet certification goals. Thank you for your interest in GeoPeer Foundation Company's innovative rammed aggregate peer foundation systems. GeoPeer is a clear-cut intermediate foundation leader because we adhere to a core purpose, delivering to you cost-effective, reliable, engineered foundation systems. We are intermediate foundations. We are here to serve you.